Hey, hey, all you heat seekers out there. Welcome back to Fat and Spicy. I'm Fat. And I'm Spicy. This is the channel that's dedicated to everything with flavor and spice and not so nice. All right, guys, today we are back from another challenge from the Inferno Candy Company Spice Box. Um, we actually, we pulled one earlier because everyone had voted for number one, but it was a maraschino cherry, and we've, since we've been doing these challenges for probably over two months now. It has exceeded its shelf life. Well, at least we weren't really sure if it had. It didn't look too bad, but again, it's been over two months, so we didn't want to play it like too, we wanted to play it safe, so. We're going to move on to the next challenge. Number uh, eight, I believe. Yeah, let's go ahead and do number eight. I think that was the next most voted one. So here's number eight, guys, which just leaves challenges number two and three right here. So make sure you comment below what you want to see next week, two or three. All right, so we have challenge number eight right here, and this is the Inferno Barbecue Chips. So there's some really hot barbecue chips. Another chip. Of course, as always, it pretty much, uh, like most of their challenges, it has habanero, ghost pepper, uh, is that, it looks like some scorpion, and uh, oh, Trinidad, it looks like the Carolina Reaper, possibly, as That's well. All. The It's a little faded on the front, so it's a little hard to read, but if, it, if it's anything like their other challenges, it has everything spicy on here, so. They are crumbly. There's oh, a bunch of them. Man, we got, got a whole pack. pack. Whole little snack pack in there. All right, so again, these are some Inferno barbecue chips. Oh, and I can smell, there's no, I don't even have to bring it to my nose. What? I can already smell it. I'm gonna slowly. Oh, yep, right there. Oh, mm. Yeah, it's, this smells hot. This almost smells like the, oh yeah, that's similar to the pocket chip smell. For a second, I was hoping it was going to be like those, um, really had like some really good barbecue Fritos or something like that. That's the first thing I thought of. I was kind of hoping there'd be some good flavor, but not from that smell. It smells like it's going to be pretty rough. Before we move on, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Uh, we just announced earlier today that once we hit 2,000 subscribers, which we are not that far off from now, we will be doing uh, pretty much the hottest hot sauce in the world currently which is K. John's Fiery Foods Black Mamba 16, the final bite. There it is, maybe you've heard of it. You probably have if you're a pepperhead or heat seeker, um, but if you haven't, just know that this thing packs a punch and this is what we're gonna do once we hit 2,000 subscribers, so. 260 needed. Yep, so hit that subscribe button, join the Fat and Spicy family because it just gets hotter from here, guys, so. All right. Let's get a couple of these. There's like three of them. Cheers. Oh. Wow. Fiery barbecue. Oh my gosh. That is a very strong flavor. <laughs> I don't know if it's the flavor or the spice. I think it's the spice. That reminds me of when we did the wasabi challenge from them. Like how the wasabi hits almost. <laughs> that is strong. Oh. It's just that same flavor that ah, this gets me every time. Yeah. Oh. I can taste the barbecue. It's good, but. Ah. Yeah, there's a little bit of barbecue. Just enough. Mm. I got tore up from the pocket chip. My stomach, I didn't get cat cramps, but almost kind of. He was pretty close. Yeah. Mm. When I was bad, that's a whole day's vacation that was gone. Ooh. ooh. Mm. Wow. Well, uh, <laughs> that's something else. Wow, I mean, it does have some barbecue flavor, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah, so the heat, the heat level, it's hot, but I think especially since we just did the one chip challenge, it's just not near that level, so it's a little bit better uh, than normal, but <clears throat> I mean, it still does pack a punch for sure. 
but it does also have some good barbecue flavor. Um, as always with these challenges, we'll leave a link in the description below for Inferno Candy Company. They have a lot of cool stuff, so make sure you check them out. Ooh. Mm. Hey, with all that being said, <coughs> remember to keep it fat and keep it spicy. See ya!